so it's your birthday yeah well it was your birthday a month ago and you said you wanted to come out but because of the kids and the amount of million and one things that we've got going on we couldn't go so i fetched you out today for your birthday meal place that you've been dying to try prashad yeah in uh, drillington and it's uh, all indian vegan vegetarian yes yeah. so booked us in today and we start we're doing the uh, taster menu so this is a little this first little taster can you remember what he said? A moose bouche. A moose bouche. A moose yeah. bouche. Yeah, so it's got beetroot. Right. Um, and then something else on top. Right. <laughs> what and is it? then some kind of, dumb. It's like a little falafel ball, isn't it? So yeah. before we start, I'm going to give this to Bina. She, she, she might nibble away on that. There you go. So she's just going to make a mess. With the proper dog, but you're gonna make a mess with the proper dog. And you're like, yeah, let's make a mess. No, I'll have a little bit like that, but we'll watch it because it might be a bit sharp. Oh, yeah, so sure. let's have a look at you because it's, it's your birthday, not mine. Yes, we're at a vegetarian restaurant, mm. so, so I'll try. We've got the proper dogs, and we've got the, the dips, and one, we've got feedy bobs because I like a good fact. One is rhubarb because we're in the rhubarb triangle. Yeah. So you've got a rhubarb dip as well. Oh, is that why they do it? Well, I assume so. <laughs> Alright. Right. So have a go. Never mind my fingers anyway. I've just realised I've put light up one way. Yeah, go on then. Have a go. Yeah, it does. Oh, it does smell like a falafel. I love falafel. It matches your lipstick. Does it? Yeah. It's a beautiful background noise. Yeah. Are you liking it, Feeny Bobs? Oh, my days. It's like a mix between a falafel and the arancini bowl. All right. That is so nice. It's like rice, um, dill, and a bit of yellow stuff. And a bit of yellow stuff. I'll just go for turmeric. You sound like you know your stuff. Let me just like wet my muscle. So, is it on me? Mhm. Mm let's give, let's give it a go. So this, so basically, there's no meat served here. Oh, bless you. There's no meat served. So it's, it's converted meat. It's nice and crispy, isn't it? So let's dip this in here. Come on, chat. Ooh, that's, that's gorgeous. Ooh, it's got a nice element of spice to it as well, isn't it? Mm. The after flavour is really nice. Well, Mine's gone. You're the only good one. Right, let's bring on the next course. Mm. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to position this now. Because it's your birthday meal. It's all on you and Feeny Bob. I don't you'll... want it all on me. Yeah. Just... Then you'll just hear me talking. Narrating. As she picks up. <laughs> the popper dumb. A beetroot. Athena Feeny. starts eating the table. Don't eat the table. She might like the beetroot. No, don't go out spicy. She needs to get her taste buds tickled. That so was tickled. Tickling yeah. mine. She see camera. She's had strong milk. Oh, yum yum yum. Not sure what she's gonna go. Oh. So she's loving it. Exploring food at the minute. She is. She's been she? trying. A lot since you've been away. Oh, I've got a nice bit of planting as well. And nice the egg, yeah. cinematic right. plant. Well, let's wait for the next one. Yeah. So, what did you think? I'm thinking they're going to have a right little look after here. We're going to have to, we're going to, have to get over here. I've been proper dumbs, but she's uh, the snap and they're dropping all over. She's loving them because they're a bit similar to flavours. So it's just like a weird soggy and milking in a mouth. <laughs> I wonder if we can convert you. Yeah. Veggie all the way. What, me? Yeah. Nah. You won't, you won't convert me, but the flavour, it's like I've had some nice veggie stuff. I must have been with you, but... I forgot to tell you, last time I came here... I thought you said you'd never been. I've never been to eat. Oh, right. I came to do Ed Balls, because I'm 
he was the Morley MP back yeah. in the day before Andrea Jenkins. Yeah. And I interviewed him here and it looked amazing and I so wanted to try and they did serve me some but I can't eat, talk and interview. So it's quite nice to sit with you instead of Ed Balls. Well, I would hope so. Looking in Ed Balls. Yeah, I'd rather go out with a vet. A vet? Yeah, a vet Cooper. Not oh. than you, I mean than Ed Balls. I thought you meant a vet as in like a vet that... <laughs> no, not a takeaway review of that. Yeah. <laughs> but all my days, it is good. I'm excited. Yeah. Warming up. And here was in the Michelin, is in the Michelin Guide. Yeah, and Michelin Gordon guide. Ramsay yeah. even loves it. So, this is your first course. Yeah. It's called Sanku. Sanku is an open samosa. It's filled with some kale and cauliflower. So we've done homemade beef with chutney, some coriander chutney on the side, and that's it of something like ice cream cone. Oh, nice. Thank you. Enjoy. Oh, thank you. Oh, she's getting giddy with this one. It's too spicy for you. Right. I'm just going to go for it. Look. Yeah, go for it. I'm in the restaurant, I keep forgetting. Oh, no, because nah. you're supposed to eat it like an ice cream, you said. No, he said it's just like an ice cream, but he said it's like an ice cream. You can use your hands. <laughs> Tastes better using your hands. What? That's not bad because it's cauliflower. Oh, is it? And you're not a massive cauliflower fan. fan. No. What is it? My taste buds are in it. That is spicy for me, I know. Oh, yes, I love it. Water, water. Right. Okay, hold on. And I, I'm doing this just for you all, not having my free wee. <laughs> free wee? Married life. I always go to the toilet before I eat. Alright. Well, you have to poo before you come out. <laughs> that was you, with windows open. This is the kind of chit chat flirting you get now you're married. That's it. She bites the top of her tongue, savours the flavour. What do you think? That is so nice. So is that spicy for you? Not for you, is it? It's no. like I will go up on spicy stir fry for breakfast. Yeah, it's just not spicy at all. It tickles your tongue. It's really tasty. It's got like cauliflower, mushrooms. Is it basil in it? Coriander. Coriander. Yeah. Basil. I don't know. I don't know my hair's been spiked because I just know what I like and I really like this. Chilly. See, I'd have this. Why can't they do ice cream bands and make might these? That might I'd be sorted. They might do an idea. I would literally be sorted. This, this is, this is so a feeling as male look. Bite in my finger. finger. Ah, she loves it. Go on. Ah. <laughs> oh my god. Good. I like the, I do like the, the beetroot chutney as well. Oh, you could use yogurt dip to cool it. I've got some yogurt dip. No, I mean yeah. for you. Wow, so I'm tired. <laughs> Such a wetter. A wetter? What's a wetter? <laughs> like, soft. No, I just... As I'm getting older, mate, I'm, I'm, I'm struggling. I even wear a kebab now with chilli on sometimes, it's too warm. Oh yeah, it did, it, it yeah. did, didn't it? He had his favourite kebab and it had chilli on. And it was just, it was just absolutely mortified. He <laughs> was sat there with top off, so you don't get that, do you? Well, if we were at home now, I'd have, I'd have my top off. You would, you would. Just one curietto, yeah. give it to me. Delicious curry, only cost it with the coriander. Oh my with days. Your, with your cauliflower curry from next Yeah, off. but tell people what you were doing. Hurrying me up. Hurrying me up? Ten, no, hurrying me up. Because there's 10 courses, we've been sat here 20 minutes on this. We've been to the toilet I'm enjoying it. Yeah, but I don't want to like wee and laugh. I've got to make my laugh now. I can I'm wee free. You've got to make your laugh. We've just been to the toilet and looked in better. See you smiling. Bad jokes again. This is so nice. See, she needs good baby nice food. Being trying to get to it, but she can't have that. Oh, look, she looks 
So I think these guys as well won the uh, Oliver Awards when they didn't they? Yeah, your evening post. I like that. There's nice punch to it. Soft in the middle. There's a bite in it. Nice bit of salt coming through. Spices, the herbs, peas. Look, it's like a pea dish. Let's try a bit of this garlic. The garlic, yeah. I'm liking this taste in my new Nice and light, isn't it? But really oh. flavoursome. What about now? What are you doing here? Oh, it's got right close. I was zooming into your peas. I just thought they could have done you in and snuck in a sweet palm. That's what I keep looking for. That's coriander, red cabbage. Red cabbage in coriander. Mm. Oh. You can sample the menu, do a mess, and then when we come back again, then you can order your favourite dishes. Yeah, what's really nice though, as well, is it's like fresh and springy, um, but then you've also got like the other elements of India, like Indian food that you're used to as well. So this like is a good choice meal. for the birthday meal. Perfect choice. Yes. Happy yeah. birthday too, me. Yeah. Only a month I do. do. <laughs> And again, peanut on your finger. Aren't right, you peanut bobs? He's like, yes, Papa. Right, by the way, what so we got here, This is your hot course. So there's puris in three different ways. So this one here is the pani puri, which is a, has a spicy coriander water in the bottom. At the top, you have the pastry with the chickpeas, potatoes, and onions. And the way you're going to have that one is just pour the water inside and pop it straight into the plate. This is the uh, sepuri, which has the spicy uh, tamarind sauce, chickpeas, potatoes, and then tomatoes and red onion. And then this one is the dehi puri, which is basically the same, uh, with the yogurt and spicy sauce instead. Lovely, thank you very much. Enjoy. Thank you. Oof. Right, do you know what? I'm going to try this one. And then I'm going to let you all do the drinking one. That's 
good. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. He's like, give me some naan. Tell you what, I'll do that one till after. Yeah, you do that one. Yeah. Right, good. I'm gonna put she bangs it in the mouth. Don't want to eat it. Put it on. What's wrong with it, Get your spice is right. flowing. You'll pick it up and I'll tip it in Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> no, she wants to try it, she, she wants to try it herself, that's what it is. And then look, you'll like this even more, Athena. Ready? Go on, team effort. Go, down in one, not down in two. Oh, yourself. I can't do it down in one. Well, it's all going to go out. That's what I said, go down in one. Oh, oh she's done it wrong, hasn't she? Yeah. You're going to show the right way. Yeah, you show the right way. Yeah. I need this here for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's really fresh yeah, on the day. It's not too spicy, it. Make sure she don't get that noodle on and I'm right, I will try it. I will do it. Oh, inside there, like that. is one of our main dishes and it's also the main street food. So that's the dosa rice electric curd. You say some fresh coconut chutney, some raw potato and onion curry, and then you got sambal soup, which is a table electric soup. And that's it how the dosa is. You break the dosa, try the pork sweet and enjoy it. Lovely, thank you very much. Right, break the dosa. Break the dosa. Oh, gotta be honest, so we're doing the, the tasting menu. What you can have here. Now a big guy. I don't eat a lot. I really am. What did you say earlier? I'm pumped. 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 So. Ooh. Is it in there? Smells amazing. We can go down into all three. The flavours start buzzing around your mouth. Not to put you off like a jar of flies. Like, it's amazing. Look at this, Danny. Look at this. Oh, it smells like that much more I can eat. Look. I'm backed out. These are some kind of. Okay. What do they say about it? Courgette fry or something? I think they're opera, yours with me. Oh, that's nice. Ooh, really nice. Right. Ooh, look at that. Oh, what's that? Oh, I thought that was. Great, Carmen. 
This is an extra you've asked for. Oh yeah, well I didn't ask what they offered. It's like a samosa shat. Samosa shat, because I was asking what the most popular dish is. And they said, well, have a go with that then. So this is like deconstructed samosa. And then the shat on top. <laughs> Whatever that is, chickpeas and yoghurt and... Oh. Being involved is loving the number out here. I feel like I need my fingers to get in there. Oh, you always would. Oh my god. Nice. Good, isn't it? That is amazing. I could literally sit. When I went to Atif's wedding, I met Atif. This is what they were serving up when I was like, when you walked in. Yeah, and then people were just saying. like spice, yogurt, yeah, yeah. tamarind. Yeah. That right, is, well, oh, this is your last main dish of your birthday meal and then we're on to dessert. Enjoy. So this is a semi course, it's your dessert, it's called pork leaf, pork with some flower shaped pastry with a filling of pecan and cranberry, and serve with some fresh blueberries and raspberries on the side, and serve with honeycomb on the bottom, and a serve with nutmeg and raisin ice cream on the side. Enjoy. Thank you, Thank you very much. Well, look, look, you can take it out here, look. Thank you, I'll pop that up for you. Thank you. Right, bob that here, look. Right. So, get back. So, we've got, look at this, it's like a little parcel of heaven. Oh, dates and pecans and. I'm going to do the three roll pastry, I'm going to do the, the, the black mini or whatever it Leave. And you've got the, the sharpness of those berries, the crunchiness of the pastry. Uh -oh. And when you come back after your birth, so I'll eat your flowers for your birth as well. Oh, thanks, love. And I can eat it as well. Yeah. I'm going to go straight into honeycomb before my little honey monster steals it down there. Yeah, come. It's good. Oh, my days. That's so good. That's like the richest honeycomb ice cream I've ever had. I've never had honeycomb ice cream, but the richest flavoured ice cream I've had. Real decadent. There you go. Right, well, I'll okay, back with you in a minute. There you go. Birthday brunch, John. One thing. Amazing. So, Rasha, we've served up seven dish tasting cars. The dessert, we're just polishing off. You've loved it. I have, honestly. I've loved it. I don't feel all sluggish either. Peanut Bob's has loved it. Thank you, Peanut Bob's. Yes. Do you like that? Isn't that nice? Oh, right, yes. But the, uh, you know, Thank there's you a lot of food much. on the tasting menu. It's really good for you. Oh. Happy days. And not a drop of meat inside. Have a drink. Not a drop or a slice. Gorgeous. Gorgeous.